Yeah, welcome to Pax Europeana. You see here the Danube and the Sava River. This is the reason why Belgrade is so important. It's the confluence of these two mighty rivers going to the Black Sea. And it's the reason why this gigantic fortress here was built in order to dominate the confluence of uh, uh, this uh, amazing two rivers. And yeah, that's basically Belgrade here. Yeah? It is a harbor, a lot of yachts and a lot of uh, uh, recreational activities. It's actually a very beautiful and growing city. The last years they have been economically stable. They, by the way, they packed their currency to the euro. That was more or less, yeah, with 170, it's stable. That was a very, very good decision. And now it's time for the euro, by the way, you know that already. But here, this is really very beautiful city. And I have to say, I like the city. I don't like the politics though. That's a stable issue. They have not been as much for peace as I hoped after the 5th of October revolution. And there was this big hope that European Serbia will be, but it was shattered on the 12th of March, 2003. And now almost 20 years, it was slow progress. And today still, unfortunately, Serbia has not joined the condemnation against this brutal attack of uh, uh, Russia, this war of Russia against Ukraine, and it keeps the airspace open. And that's all completely wrong, obviously. I condemn that. And it's also time to recognize Kosovo. This is absolutely the time to join the West fully and to be also part of the European Union then, together in 2029 with the others who are also going in now. I think the things are all changing and the attitude towards, towards Europe is changing and that's very good and I hope there will be changes now. Yeah, this is the entry here. This is Kalimekdan. This is the fortress itself. This is the church. It looks very similar to the church in Kiev and it's the same religious traditions. Yeah. That's always why I'm so surprised it's not possible to find a common understanding. Serbia unfortunately has not understood the Arumaitan revolution and has not drawn the conclusions. It's stuck in a past of a great Russian empire and has not understood the true nature of Putinism. And now under the hammering blows of Mariupol, uh, the destruction, I think here they have television and I'm sure it will change. The effect will be a European survey, I'm confident. And that's what is necessary now. And I call for exactly that, a European Serbia. A Serbia which is really fully part of the West, uh, inside NATO, EU, recognizing Kosovo and supporting Ukraine. Serbia has a good weapons industry. They can deliver a lot of things to Ukraine now, which is needed. And I call for that. Uh, arms for Ukraine, closing the airspace and being a full ally. Show that you want to be part of the West. Vote against Vucic, against the pro-Putin stability and then to join the free world fully. That is very important and that will be the breakthrough and the life of all Serbs will be much better as EU citizens, the same as the Austrians. No need to leave, but just to join. I think that's a wonderful future ahead. Look, the similarities to Kiev are very close. And I hope that this Ukrainian-Serbian friendship will prosper in the future. And that's my call here from this beautiful place. Thanks a lot for watching. More to come from Pax Arubiana here from Kalimekdan in Serbia. Bye.